From the KCHS studio at Capitol High School. This is KCHS TV. Where, where excellence, excellence happens. happens. Teachers and staff, we need you or announcements. Please email any announcements you may have to kchs.capital at gmail.com. And please give a 48-hour advance notice. Good morning, Capital, and great Tuesday morning. I'm Riley Kay. And I'm Valor Keckley. Please stand with the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Welcome back, Eagles, and thank you for joining us on KCHS. We are your source for upcoming events, sources, and much, much more. KCHS, KCHS TV, TV starts, starts now. now. Seniors, you should have received an email showing how your name will be spelled on your diploma. Please verify and correct the information if needed before Monday, March 13th. If your name needs to be corrected, please see Mr. Mrs. Rogers in the counseling office. The marketing program, DECA, will be hosting an annual Make-A-Wish fundraiser throughout the week of March 13th through the 17th with a school-wide assembly happening on Friday, March 17th. This year, we are sponsoring a seven-year-old, Gael, who has a respiratory issue. Gael's wish is to go to San Diego to visit Legoland and the zoo, as well as whale watching. In order to make Gael's wish come true, you need to help. Over the, week, a couple, over the next couple of weeks, marketing and DECA students will be selling stars for $1 each. The stars will be hung on the hallways representing the support for Gael in the class. Who has purchased the most number of stars will get, a pie to te will get the pie to teacher of their choice to the Make-A-Wish assembly. Remember to bring some cash to school, find a marketing student, and let them know you want to buy a star. Thanks for your support to make Gael's wish come true. And now for a quarter of the day. Believe you can, and you're halfway there. T.S. Eliot. Sports. Athletes, please make sure you have completed the sportswear information and have your physical on file. If you are unsure, please see Mrs. Ariola. And now we go out to Rory O'Connor and Ryan Gongora for our preseason sports interviews. Hi, Capital. I'm Ryan Gongora here with... I'm Aya McLean. Track star. How many years have you been a part of uh, track? Uh, I think it's been five years since seventh grade. Nice. <laughs> what are some individual goals that you wish to accomplish this season? Um, I'm trying to get to state and hurdles this year and then um, score the varsity time for the 100 meter. Okay. Big goals. Uh, what are some goals you have for the team that you aspire to achieve? Um, I really want the girls to um, bring home a trophy at state, even if it's not like in the top three, just a trophy. <laughs> Sounds lit. Thank you for your time. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Clay, yeah. Back to the desk. Thank you guys for that update. And Remy here for our fun fact of the day. Did you know that a jar of Nutella sells every 2.5 seconds? Remy, back to bring you today in history. On this day, February 28th, 1935, Wallace Carothers produced the first plastic-based products at the DuPont Experimental Station in Wilmington, Delaware. Stay safe, stay tuned, and fly straight and subscribe so you never miss an update. Have an awesome day, Capital. We'll see you on the next KCHS, KCHS News. Tuesday night. Thank you for being here with us. I'm the KCHS team. We hope to see you back here tomorrow evening. Good night.